In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a Twitch clip command that creates a clip and also send it to Discord straight away. It's simple. Yo, welcome back to Simple Streaming guys, my name is Aslix. Before we begin, I just want to let you guys know that I also stream on Twitch. So if you want to get to know me, hang out, watch me play games, know me better, or just give me a support, follow me on Twitch and see you there. And also don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you want more and you like this content. But anyway, let's get into the video. A shout out to Special Agent Squeaky. He made this possible by making a website and create this webhook for this to happen. All right guys, so head over to the link that I'll show you below the description. We're gonna scroll a little bit down and access to create Twitch clips. Click here to grant permission. It will basically ask you to get permission to your Twitch channel and you log in with your channel info, do that. And then target Twitch channel. To be specific which channel you creating a clip for, type in your channel name. Uh, normally it will be your own channel, but you can also create a clip command for an, any other channel if you want. Then here comes the important part, Discord webhook URL. So to do this, you have to open your own Discord. You see this cog wheel uh, on any channel, create a channel if you want for your clips. Uh, I already got one, I already tried this yesterday. So click, create this uh, there, go to integration and you'll see webhook, you click on that and you make a new webhook. I already done one, so uh, yeah, you can create one and it will, it will give a random name, Spideybot. You can call it like Clipbot, like I did, like this. You type in a name and then you click copy web URL. Then you go up back to the website and you copy it in this field right there. You can already send a test message to Discord. So click send test message. And you'll see on your Discord, you already got, this is a test message. A new clip was created by user, smiley face, and an emoji that doesn't show on my end for some reason, I don't know why. If you scroll a little bit down, you can see Discord message. You can, you can alter it like uh, how you want to say, like somebody, somebody, hey guys, go check this out. A uh, message, a clip was created by use this dollar sign user and exclamation mark that it will show the username from from Twitch and then sunglasses and this number here this is uh, basically what kind of emote you want I will show this at the end of the video how you can change your own emote all right moving on the second one Twitch chat message this is the message that will be posted in Twitch chat after the clip has been created so here we got User just posted a new clip to Discord server and a link. You can edit this if you will, but I will stick to the original because it's simple, it's the easiest. So go back, scroll a little bit down. You can apply a, if you want uh, the Twitch link to be sent into the Discord message. If you want it to link a link to, for you to download the MP4 video. And also if you, if there's gonna be a edit link so you can change the clip title. I'll say just keep it all on yes. And then finally, get the super secret password. And then we're done, basically. So click to get the password and then you just copy it at the end here. Once you paste it, you go and create a clip command. Once you've done that, you will see a page that looks like this. You can see here, it's support Stream elements, Nightbots, Stream Deck, Streamless OBS, and so on. So basically you create a custom command, create a clip, and you post this link. I'm gonna show you. Clip a new, create a new command. You named it clip. You set it to everyone, and you just paste it. I don't know, I don't have it right now. It says Mario 6, but you get the link and you paste it here. And then you activate it. 
And once you're done, you're good to go. You can test it out. Here is an example of some friends of mine. I, they call lasagnas. I suggest you to check them out. They are amazing streamers. They do IRL stream. So they're using the same bot as I do, as I'm showing in the video. So it will show like, here's the name. Uh, a new clip was created by somebody, somebody. All right. Then here's the name of title of the clip. You can click this link to rename the clip. Here's the link for the Twitch clip, which is shown here in the Discord. And also a link that you can click on to download the video MP4 file, which you can edit yourself. Uh, I don't know, save it if you want it. Like you can, you can save it down to edit later. It's really useful. And finally, how to add your own emote to the message. I'm gonna show you right now. So you go back to Discord, you click on your user setting, and then you go to advanced. You click on, it's normally off, but if you have this on, then you're good to go. You can click on develop mode, close it. Then you can select an emote. So I think you ha have to have Nitro, like Discord Nitro to show it like this one here. I don't know, but normally like, let's say joy, you post a joy emote, then the name, if you hover your mouse over it, hover your mouse over it, it will show joy. And then if you click more, you can show double right click, copy ID, then you can paste it there. So there you got the ID. So the name of this emote is like this, joy, right? Same like I typed. So you go back to the website and under the discord message, like here, a clip was created by user sunglass. So we're going to keep the sunglass one, but let's say that I do this. I changed this name to joy. And then remember the number that we just copied, you change it change the number and then voila let's send a test message there you go test message and it's changed and if you're streaming it's gonna work straight away with uh, everything so that was the tutorial very simple right if you enjoyed this video make sure to give this video a thumbs up leave a comment down below if this helped you or if you have any questions or any other idea of video you want me to make, let me know. And once again, I do stream on Twitch sometimes. So go check me out. See ya.